Hey guys, Ernie Kitchen here, and here we go with another weekly spread. So as you know, you're going to upload the weekly spread into Procreate and import it in as a photo. And as you know, we're going to go ahead and upload our spread from Pink Pixel Graphic, and I use the Not Too Shabby Monthly Kit. So it's not her weekly kit, but it's a monthly kit. Alright, and I'm just going to go ahead and use this beautiful shabby chic washi that she has here and go ahead and cut it out and my, make my placement and then duplicate it for the top and bottom. All right, to save some time, we're gonna go ahead and pinch those four pieces together to make one layer. And I'm going to go ahead and add another layer. And what I'm doing here is making my side washi. So I'm going to select that little square, um, the second one to the bottom. And I'm just comparing to see how close it looks to the washi that I cut out. So as you can see right there, I'm cutting it there. And I'm going to cut it where it's almost invincible, invisible, sorry. And then now I'm going to rotate it and kind of like we did last week, kind of create my own little washi with this. So I'm going to make one piece and then I'm going to duplicate it, keeping on magnetic, slide it down to attach it. Then I'm going to merge those two together so it remains that length, duplicate that slide it down, and so on and so forth. All right, so once we're done with all of that, we're simply gonna put those together, duplicate that whole line, and move it over to the other side of the planner. All right now, so I am getting another layer and I'm gonna get that cute quote there with the bicycle that says, life is a beautiful ride, which it truly is. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut that piece out there and place it in my planner. All right, so now let's go ahead and select another piece of the Spread. And what I'm doing here is getting that beautiful yellow um, sticker there and I am going to cut it down to size and I'm going to put that over my days of the week. Since I'm using the monthly spread, again it doesn't have the Monday through um, Sunday rectangles that I usually have already pre-cut so I'm just going to make my own and I thought this yellow was so cute um, and in contrast with the red roses there and I really like that yellow so much that I might use it again later and kind of create my own washi with it so now I am going to go to my layers panel and merge all of those days of the week rectangles together so that they're one layer and I'm just going to clean up behind them, so um, just do a little bit of finishing touches when it comes to cleaning up the, the um, what's visibly seen from layer one. And I'm going to grab another piece of sticker and I'm going to go ahead and make my sidebars. So same process where you make your own, where you duplicate, merge, duplicate, merge. Alright, I'm going to finish that up and what I'm going to do here is go ahead and put all my layers where I want them to be and I'm going to select a file from Pink Pixel where she has dedicated some Monday through Friday stickers for those of us that go rogue and decide to choose our own Monday through 
Sunday, excuse me, stickers versus the one that she has pre-made in her spreads. And now what I'm doing is, is just picking out, since there's so many different colors, kind of looking and seeing what matches with the numbers that she has provided for us with this spread and to see what I feel closely matches with the whole layout. So doing my little magic chop and I'm going to place my days of the week. I will go ahead and um, hide that layer where you can see the other stickers in a minute, but I was just trying to see exactly how it would look. All right, now it's time to um, move my layers around again and go ahead and select my dates of the week. So this week we're going from the 23rd to the 29th and the 27th is my birthday. So make sure you comment below and give me a little happy birthday shot. I would really appreciate it. So now, after that, I'm going to go back to my layer one panel and do some real deep cleaning and getting rid of some lines and some little excess things that I may see that I didn't notice before. All right, all done. Now let's export it to Good Notes. So I'm in my planner and I'm going to select picture and go ahead and place it as close as I possibly can inside of my planner. So I'm going to go ahead and get my water tracker and I'm happy to report that I am up to 8 ounces so I can go ahead and put my regular cup amounts in there without all the different ones and since my layout is a little different I'm going to have to place my cups and my tracker a little differently so um, I'm just going to go ahead and place my hourly tracker and then put my cups for my water intake. Okay, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and place two water bottles here. This is totally me. If you know me at all, this is, this shabby chic is all me. But thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing your weekly spreads, and I'll see you next week. Give me a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe.